What's up guys, Chris Ninja here, and um, today I'm going to be trying to destroy this life-proof case, you know, as you can see, it's actually life-proof, if you, if you can, if it wants to, if, come on camera, focus, Fo not on my face, not, not on my face, but that says life-proof, anyway, we're going to try and destroy this life-proof case, because I bought a new one, because this one kind of kind of got worn down a little bit because the weight fell on it if you watch my new year's video from like a year and a half ago but um i figured it was time to get a new one and now i'm going to see what it takes to destroy one of these so you know first things first i mean i, I guess first thing we got to do we got to throw it on the ground or something like that so let's get into it okay guys so my life crew started falling apart a little while ago so like see there was supposed to be like a little cover there to like put the earphone jack in and like keep it from uh filling up with water but I mean, like, since that fell off, could could I fill it up with water? And would that destroy it? Or is the rest of it waterproof? So while that's filling up in there, I'm going to go... Hold up. Editing, Chris, if I see this in the video, I'm getting smacked. All right, but... All right, let, let's see. Let's see. Okay, so you might not be able to see it, but surprisingly for how long I kept it in that water, that's not that much. So, I mean like... And it's only coming out that one spot too. So, obviously... Wait a second. Hold up a second. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold up. If I put this in there without without pressing down on it, no water be getting in there. Okay, okay, life proof. I see you making your products good. Um, now, this would never happen if you actually had your phone in it, but, but check this out. Look. Just, just crushed it open. I know you saw that. All right, guys. Here's test two, the smash test. So we just going. I mean, like the rubber's coming out, but like the case itself is still intact. So I mean, like, are we gonna count this as it as it failed? Or actually, no. We can take the. I think we can take the rubber out. Cause like I don't need I don't need it. It's really more about like is the case gonna hold up? But I mean the case the case is still intact. So I mean like I guess it worked. So let's take a knife. I have no. I'm playing. I'm not. I'm not that stupid. I'm stupid, but I ain't that stupid. All right, let's see if uh, let's see if a knife can go through the back. Oh, 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 oh! Got a little bit of damage there. A little, little bit of damage. But as you can see, the knife only goes like a little tiny bit in there. So like that's some thick plastic. I don't know if you can see the knife in there, but like it, it only went. It only went like that deep into it. It didn't even come out the other side. Um, looks like the screen protector is fine too. Like the screen protector, even though I was chopping it with the knife, the knife didn't do nothing to screen protector. So I mean, like th this thing. I mean, like, like I mean, look, look. I mean, like, if you, as you can see, the knife did not slice through it. It, like, it's got a couple stab wounds on the back, but you know, it, it's fine. It's fine. So yes, I am on the floor. 
but this is just so I can show like the other part, another part of the video. So you know how you be playing video games like, uh, I don't know, Geometry Dash, Flappy Bird, and then it just makes you want to do this. Well, with your life proof, your phone might not survive the pixels, but as you can see, the case is just fine. <laughs> Let's pop it open real quick. Oh, oh look at that padding. Padding is starting to come out. The padding that protects your phone is starting to fall out. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what more games we can do. I mean, but honestly, if you take a look at it, like, if you didn't know this was a life proof that had been smashed and stomped on and thrown and stabbed, I mean, it it still looks durable enough to, like, protect the phone. Like, I'm not saying I'd put my phone back in here or anything, but, like, I might trust it with, I might trust it with my phone again. Like, I don't know, man. Thing built like a Nokia. All right, guys. So here's another test you could. I'm gonna do. Uh, throw it down the stairs. Hopefully nobody sees this and thinks I'm crazy. I mean, I mean, a couple scratches. It still looks, still looks just fine. So, as, as you guys may or may not know, I can kick a football pretty well. In fact, I think Chris put put a clip up, put a clip right, like right there, put a clip right there. Perfect. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna see if kicking this thing will do any damage to it. I, I doubt it because stomping on it did nothing. Okay, so since I'm not on any even ground, like since there's no even ground around me, like right now, other than like the middle of the road, but I, if I kick this pretty hard and it goes flying, I don't want it to hit somebody's window or something like that which could cause some real damage, potentially. So, uh, we're just gonna punt it and see what happens. Like, it sounds like, it sounds like plastic is breaking. Hold up. Oh, wait, we lost a piece of plastic. The, the little thing that protects the camera has fallen. So, looks like we did enough damage to break that off unless it fell in here, which I don't see it. So, you know, we're making progress. Lovely camera woman, my mom. Uh, we, we can try hitting it with a hammer. So, let's see. as you can see, that's all the damage the hammer did. That that's it. That's it. All right. So this is the ultimate test. Could your life proof case survive being run over with a car? I will now demonstrate that for you. Remember. Don't try this with your phone in the case. That's why I'm testing this without my phone in the case. Ah, uh, you missed it. Yeah. Oh, you got it that time. Yep, you got it. All right, hold on, hold on. One more time, just like. Am I on it? Nope, you just passed it. Just a little bit more. Stop. Let's just uh, sit on that for a second. And then back up one more time. Alright guys, so let, let's take a look at this. Um, as you can see, it has quite a few scratches. But no real damage. Like, I mean, like it popped open and everything, but like, as you can see, look, look there's like really no damage. Nope, it survived being run over. This could still probably protect your phone if you were to put this in there. But most likely. Hold on, we do actually have some damage here. This will not close like it's supposed to anymore. This is supposed to lock and seal so that water doesn't get in your phone, but and it's to cover your charging port, and this will not close anymore. As you can see, look. It will not close anymore. I mean, but basically it can protect your phone from basically anything. This is life proof. Life proof, please sponsor me. Now life proof, that's Chris Minja on YouTube in case you do want to sponsor me. I'm pretty
improving your product is basically in this truck. Welcome. Pull up slowly. You're getting it. You got it that time. All right. I know y'all saw that life proof. Life proof you're watching. You, you can give me a sponsorship and I'll let you use the video for your for your website. All right, I'm going to park and we'll, we'll inspect the damage. Oh, oh goodness, guys. Looks like it popped the whole thing open. But even a tire, even a full car with the tire on it doesn't even crack the screen protector. The only thing that actually cracked the screen protector is the hammer. As you can see on the back, the only thing that actually punctured through was a knife. And the only thing that got it more dented than a, than a dumbbell was an actual hammer being swung down with force. So basically, if you're looking for the best case to support your phone for whatever you need it for, whether it be rock climbing or sports or whatever you're doing, go with LifeProof. LifeProof is probably the best choice for like protecting your phone. It's durable, as you can see, even though, like, like this, this is, keep in mind, this is after I ran over it, smashed it, submerged it in water, stabbed it. It still closes. The only thing is, the only thing is that this won't, this won't shut anymore. So, if, I mean, like, honestly, if you snap this off, you still got a decent case. Protects you from drops, scratches, falls, water, if the whole thing's together. And, like, even though now it's, like, really fragile and easy to pull apart, because it no longer fits together properly after being run over not once, twice, three, or four times, about like six or how many times was it? I'll count them, I'll count them the editing. Like six times it got ran over. So basically, life proof is indestructible. And if you need a life proof case, go buy one.